So do you remember I said, yeah, I know where that door takes us? That's where that door takes us. That one actually takes us outside to the parking lot. And that takes us back upstairs. And I forgot to pick that lock. Actually going to go out to the parking lot. I'm not sure there's a few mutants out in the parking lot that I could bump off as well. Just sure hell of bumping everybody off. So these are the mutants that Ericsson actually came to the island with. I like the fact that he actually has like a proper name. You know, it's, it, he's not like strong or well, I suppose Fox actually named himself like a fox rising from the ashes. But I like that Ericsson actually has a proper name. I like that. Um, Oh, okay. You know, the same as uh, Marcus had a name and, you know, so it gives you the idea that they're not quite the same as the rest of them. He's a little bit of a difference. It would remind you more of the first gen than these ones that remind you quite a lot of third gens. Pop your head out and I'll tell you. I'll pop your head out and I'll show you what the hell just happened there. Did somebody just jump? Did I just walk myself all the way back out again? Right back in. I'm looking for things to kill. Alright, I've been there. Yeah, that's how you jump. Nikki, why are you jumping into water? Okay, now I'm putting the lights on, I can't see a thing. This place has a lot of ammo. Haha, -ha, level two. No, oh, we're just here, weren't we? Oh, well, that didn't go anywhere. <laughs> I'm walking in circles, literally. There's a mutant around here somewhere. It shouted. Okay, stuff that. I give up. Nicky, we're out of here. I'll find him some other way. really do be dropping a lot of stuff off, Nagy. Okay. Why is there so much radiation on this island? Does anybody know? I need to go to one of my settlements and drop off a lot of this stuff I'm carrying, so... We shall go to... There. And drop it all off. Then we'll go and find 
sister, whatever her name is. And then we shall access the memories. Yeah, that one's fun to do. Can you hear the sarcasm in my voice? I'm going to explode with happiness. <laughs> Right, I'm still carrying too much. Why? That would do it. We're in a world. Oh, it was Warner's Bray. Okay. Time to go and find the nutty woman. Um, sh shrine and a cross, I would say. Okay, you seriously telling me, well I can see like there was a bit of a party, but are you seriously telling me some idiot had a canister of aluminium with oil in it or whatever and threw it on top of... Alright. You are. Okay. Some people really should not be allowed near anything to do with fires. Really shouldn't. Right. Anybody seen Jason? <laughs> I'm waiting for him to pop out here. These blood cans. <laughs> Not that hard to take down Nucky. You don't say.
tiny speck of matter surrounded by endless depths. Vast emptiness that dwells within us all. It only reaffirmed what I'd felt all this time. The truth the Confessor wanted no one to hear. The lie that is Adam. It's not real. We aren't all infinite worlds. Just empty space. Dead. Cold. Professor won't be pleased by my messages. But I'm not afraid. I'm going to start moving things to the old church by the West Access Road in case. In case they decide to join them. I, I just hope I'm not too late to save them from Adam's life. Yeah, I don't actually know if they put the wee eyeball in with the brains to make them more disturbing looking. It actually just made them look funnier. They look like the wee, the, the wee dopey things you get with the Google eyes. Kind of way. Oh, damn. The truth of nothing? Holy hell, she went from, she, she literally went from children of Adam to atheist. I have seen it with my own eyes. A void so vast and empty. Like a night sky without the stars. I know it is difficult to accept. But you must. And so must the others. They deserve to know the truth. Why must they? Look, I know you think you're trying to save the children of Adam. But you could be wrong. It's not too late to turn back and atone for your actions. I wish I could believe that. Fear and doubt have blinded you, sister. But I think, in your heart, you don't really believe any of this. Blinded by fear and doubt. I can't deny the truth of those words. How would I have been such a fool? I was a child of Adam. One of the beloved. I must seek forgiveness from the others. Please tell Red to her that. I will return soon. I'll accept whatever punishment is deemed just. Oh, I would rather have done that later, but I have to do it now. Trying to loot in this place. Ha ha. Put a bit of light on the situation. Disturbing yes. my church has to padlock its first aid supplies. Uh, it's just wrong. Oh, bananas. <laughs> 